Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 3 Module 3 Lesson 5 homework. So let's get started. Number one, use number bonds to help you skip count by seven um, by making 10 or adding to the ones. All right, so A, we have seven plus seven. And we know that seven only needs three more to get to the next 10. And when we're adding numbers, it's usually easier to add from a 10. So they took apart one of the sevens and to three and they have four left over. So they brought seven and three together to make 10. And we can't forget about the four. So 10 plus the four is 14. So seven plus seven is 14. All right, and B, we have 14 plus seven. 14 needs six to get to the next 10. So they broke apart seven into six and one. 14 plus six would be 20 plus one. So 20 plus one is 21. All right, and C, 21 plus seven. So here, um, it's easier also to um, add from a 10. If we break apart 21 to 20 and one, we have a 10 right here. So then we combine the seven and the one. So we have 20 plus eight is 28. So 21 plus seven is 28. All right, and D, we have 28 plus seven. 28 only needs two more to get to the next 10. So we take two from seven. 28 plus two is 30. And then plus the five is 35. So 28 plus seven is 35. All right, E, 35 needs five more to get to the next 10. So we take five from seven and we get two left over. Three, five, and five combined, we have 40, and then plus the two is 42. So 35 plus seven is 42. All right, F, 42 plus seven. Uh, all right. And we can break apart into 40 and that gives us two left over. 7 plus 2 combined is 9, but we already have a 40 here, which is to the next 10, so that's easier to add. So we have 40 plus 9, that's 49. Alright, G, 49 plus 7. 49 needs one more to get to 50, so we take 1 from 7, that gives us 6 left over. Combine this number together, 49 plus 1 is 50, plus 6 is 56. All right, in H, we have 56 plus seven. 56 needs four more to get to 60. So we borrow four from seven, and that gives us three left over. Combine this together. 56 plus four is 60, plus three, and that is 63. Oh, yeah. All right, next page. Number two, we have skip count by seven to fill in the blanks. Then fill in the multiplication equation and use it to react to use it to write the related division fact directly to the right. Alright, so here it's really important to know our time seven multiplication facts. Let's start at the very bottom. Let's start over here and write and skip count by seven. So we have seven plus seven, that would be 14, 21, 28 plus seven is 35, 42, 49. Plus 7 would be 56, and then 70, uh, wait, 56, and then 63, and then now we have 70. So that was skip counting by 7. Now let's move on to the next column. 7 times 1 is 7. 7 times 2 is 14. 7 times 3 is 21. 7 times 4 is 28. All right, now you might start noticing a pattern. The answers over here on this column is the same as the answers on this column. 20 and 28, 21, 21, 14, 14. That's because when we're skip counting by seven, that's also kind of like multiplying by seven. Like pretend we skip count four times 28. That would be the same as seven times four, which is 28. So now seven times five would be 35. Seven times six would be 42. 7 times 7, 49. Um, 7 times 8 would be 56 and 63. And 7 times 10 would be 70. So let's move on to division now. Blank divided by 7 equals blank. 
So it has to match the facts to on the other columns. So the first column we have seven times one equals seven. So here we write seven divided by seven equals one. And now here we have 14 divided by seven equals two. 21 divided by seven equals three. That's also because seven times three is 21. Here we have 28 divided by seven and that is four. 35 divided by seven would be five. 42 divided by seven would be six. Now 49 divided by seven would be seven. 56 divided by seven would be eight. And then 63 divided by seven is nine. And 70 divided by seven is 10. Notice how we have 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So yeah. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.